You know what I mean, Kevin, about getting freaky? Uh, well, I know I know one person who does. <laughs> That's a great segue. Great segue. Look at that. So if you guys didn't see the news or you live under a rock yesterday, Shannon Sharp inadvertently went live. I don't even know how he did this, but he went live by accident on IG while he was getting busy. And it went everywhere. Uh, he actually ended up owning up to it on the, the Nightcap Show. And we're going to react to that in just a moment. But I did ask the poll here. Uh, should Shannon Sharp keep his job after going live on IG while having sex? And actually, I'm a little bit surprised by this. There's a 60-40 split. 60% of you guys so far are saying that, no, it was a mistake and he owned it. And 40% saying, yes, people were canceled for less so far on that poll. I, I, I will agree for yeah. that. People have been canceled for less. Should we play the clip then and then we'll react on the other side of what Ocho Cinco and Shannon were talking about? Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's play it. There is someone that is extremely private. The audio heard for the entire world to hear. People count on Shannon, Shea Shea Media Club, Shea Shea Nightcap, ESPN, and I always try to be professional, even when I'm behind closed doors. I'm very disappointed in myself, not for the act, but for to have the audio to be heard. My kids call them, I call my sister, but God, this was not staged. Came in, I threw my phone on the bed, gazed in an activity. All of a sudden, people are calling me, Shannon, you're on IG Live, they can hear. I'm like, doing what? Like you were having sex, man. And my heart sank. It dropped. I said, I just got to tell them the truth. My phone wasn't hacked. It was me being active. I can't lie. I built these sparks hard. <laughs> phone ring. Cat Williams. You ain't gay today. <laughs> We human. We all partake in horizontal and vertical activity. You're not very good at technology. You've done it to me. I was upset, but then I also remember that you're not very technically savvy, but the fact that it was a Michelle and not a Michael, <laughs> ah, that's my dog. <laughs> Oh my goodness. It, it was uh, so a couple things there. What I do appreciate with Shannon Sharp is he didn't make any excuses. He's like, yep, that was me. I own up to it. I will say, I think the other part of this, it does help that there's only an audio format, which uh, that yep. very much that I, probably talking about, saved him. Probably why you still would have a job is if that was a video format, Kevin, if that was a uh, movie theater esque. Uh. Well, I mean, be, being a Nuggets fan, I will never forget the day that I woke up oh. and I had 10 friends either call or text and they said, what, what, what's your guy, Jamal Murray doing? I said, what are you, what, what, what are you talking about? Bad. What are you talking about? <laughs> and if you want, you're talking video form. That was, well, that was video form. As I, I didn't, I didn't expect to, to see what I saw that day. So it, it feels like um, a moment though for Shannon, you know what uh, he, he, I'm glad he just he owned up and said he's disappointed because he also what I love this is I'm not disappointed in the act. Yeah, he's not, it wasn't like, apologizing for the act. That's what no. I thought was the best too. Like he he well, owned no. up to that, but he was very unapologetic about you know getting it in, which he shouldn't he was, be. He was sorry that it that it went live. It, he was sorry that his kids had to like that. that yeah. that's, the, that's the part right there where the whole world gets to see your private life, but specifically your family, your kids. Yeah, that's yeah, where it goes. Yeah. The quote engaged in an activity in there <laughs> actually is absolutely hysterical. Engage in activity is not wrong. And you know what? He's an adult. He can make adult decisions. Um, but Good for man, him. that that was tough. But then he turned, he flipped the switch after the, the apology. Yep, I feel disappointed. I'm sorry that that's the way it happened. And uh, he he's run with it. And I think there's only a few people that can actually get away with saying, yep. He's one of them. Yep, I, uh, I was... Uh, yeah, I was doing like a couple extracurriculars and, uh, you know, and they were making fun of his cardio after it and all of that. And hey, but you know what? Props to Shannon. <laughs> for, saying, props to Shannon for owning up to it. I will That's say the, hard thing to the own Internet's up to. just incredible because some of the memes that come out of it immediately, like Shannon interviewing Shannon on Club Shay Shay, like yeah. all those ones, it's like coming tonight. Like all of those, like the <laughs> Internet acts so fast. And sometimes I get so jealous because I'm like, this is brilliant. Like, why couldn't I have come up with this? Yeah. It was absolutely incredible. I, I just, and the, the, the viewers are coming in. I'm actually really surprised. It's actually starting to even out here almost 50, 50 mm -hmm. on people who think he should lose his job versus not. Um, if you do think that Shannon Sharp should no longer be on first take, on ESPN, which by the way, he wasn't on today, isn't on tomorrow, but that's his regular schedule. And according to sources, 
He will be back on Monday for first take. So it'll be interesting to see what the dynamic is between Stephen A. Who else is on that show? Is it going to be Kmart? Who's it going to be? Because like they can't just let this go. I don't know if you guys saw, but Ryan Clark actually put out a, a tweet about how before Nightcap came on about how Nightcap was going to be lit. And so like, you know, there's already ESPN folks like making fun of the situation. So uh, either way, I thought the way that he handled it was was as best it was as good as you could have uh and uh, he handled it in, in typical shannon sharp fashion yeah I, and they're definitely gonna uh, jab him <laughs> for it on monday no doubt about it probably a little bit more uh courteous on there because there's certain you know on on the networks that which you can't say that's why on with nightcap with him and ocho cinco they weren't holding anything back also that people were speculating online that a, a former a, espn employee what was michelle beetle yeah, that, yes. that they thought it was her because of the name Michelle, and she tweets out, "It wasn't me. It wasn't me." <laughs> that was like because out of context, you oh. have no clue. She just tweets out, "It wasn't me." Like that was it. <laughs> that was the that was the tweet. Word for it, it wasn't me, and everyone's like, "Oh my god!" Yeah, you know, well, wasn't Michelle on on air anyway? Because she does the radio show with uh, Beetle and Decker on uh, Mad Dog. Yeah. It, it, well, the, the thing is, just that's where the internet just goes nuts. Yeah, you know? yeah. It's, it's that's the part of it that's so funny that she had to then, because people were <laughs> speculating, that's where it is. Don't you love? You know, it? everybody's talking to the Mich- any Michelle they know. You know. Yeah. Who has? But you know what? Um, not that for the world to hear, but in their own private time, I hope they had a good time. But everyone knows <laughs> about it. 